Hey, this is John, and the tool I'm going to be talking about today is called Audacity. It is a tool that I use to record and edit audio that I use for different things in my business. Now, I'm going to start this off with a disclaimer that I hate editing things. I do not like editing audio. I don't like editing video. I don't like editing images or pictures or web pages or anything. I don't like to edit things. But... The reason I'm showing you this is because I think it's important to understand how to edit things so that you're not always 100% dependent on someone else. Where if you want to get rid of an um in an audio, you can do it. Or if you want to cut out three frames out of a video, you can do it. So let me show you, I'm just going to show you real quickly how to use Audacity. If I want to record something in Audacity, come in, click the record button, and it's going to record you. Pretty simple. Stop. If I, if I made a mistake, I can go back, I get the cursor tool, and I'm going to highlight this, and cut that out, and I'll stop, or start it again, well let me listen to where I was, record you. okay, so the last thing I said was record you, so let's put the cursor at the end, and now I can continue recording again, and hopefully get them to work correctly. So stop it, and now you see that I have both things recorded. So let's say I wanted to cut that out a little bit. I'm going to grab this tool, slide it over here so they're a little bit closer. Grab that and get rid of this n noise on this bottom one. Cut that. Whoops, I got them too close. So let's slide that back now. That's about right. So now it should play a little bit more how I want it to play. Let me also show you how you can edit out certain certain pieces of things. So let's say I'm going to add in, right here we're going to do a little bit more recording. As I'm talking, I say um a lot. Um, I don't like when I do this, so we'll stop it. Let's see where I said um. I say um a lot. Okay, let's stop. So this was an um. Let's get rid of that um with an effect. We're going to use the amplify effect to get rid of this and we're going to make this a negative amplification. Okay, and you see that this came down. Now we can do repeat amplify and it's getting smaller. We can repeat that until it's pretty low. I say, oh, a lot. Um, and that got really quiet. Now you could also uh, cut that out so we could do this and crop it and now I don't say I don't say anything anymore another thing you might want to know how to do is generate silence so in these sections if your microphone may be a little loud you can say generate silence and now it made that line perfectly flat so that there's no noise in there anymore super nice now at the end of this, when you're done recording or editing or whatever, you can export it as an MP3, you can export it as a WAV file, you can save the project. What I'll often do is export it as an MP3 and then use that either as a product for someone or give that to one of my guys in the Philippines as here are instructions or whatever. Pretty simple to record as an MP3. Audacity is free software. It's pretty simple to use. It's pretty powerful. Um, powerful audio editing and since it's open source it will always be free. Another reason I'm showing you this is because most editing softwares are very similar. Uh, they have different interfaces but in general what you're going to want to do is select things and cut things and, and improve or decrease the audio. Um, you can make audio louder here by selecting it and doing an amplify and instead of a negative we could do a positive amplify this time and now that just got louder now this will distort the audio a little bit but this works across almost all editing audio and video editing software so once you learn one the next one is way easier to learn and now you're not dependent on someone else which here's my case for that uh, recently I've been working on a project where we had some videos to do and if I would have had to have waited for someone else to do to do a couple very minor video tweaks, uh, it probably would have taken days for each of them for them to get it done. It took me about 15 minutes each, 
uh, just because I already knew how to do it. And so instead of being put off a week, we were put off half an hour and the project can continue. So this is how you use Audacity. I use it quite a bit to edit audio, uh, to record audio, and it's free. And there should be a link on this page for where you can find it.